Welcome to Heritage at Stonebridge. And that's what I'm talking about today. So let's get started. Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm Angela O'Hare, your favorite Las Vegas realtor. And I got a little Aussie with me, so if you hear any grunts or snorting or whatever, it's not me, it's my boy Ozzy, okay? <laughs> Anyways, and today I'm gonna be talking about the newest 55 plus community by Lennar in Summerlin. And it's called Heritage at Stonebridge, which is obviously in the Stonebridge Village, just really right on the edge of Stonebridge and it's really super close to Red Rock Canyon. So this community is gonna have about 421 homes and they're gonna have about nine different floor plans to choose from, which is pretty awesome, with three different collections. If you know anything about Lennar, they have an everything included package, which means that you will get upgraded appliances, upgraded race panel cabinetry, granite countertops, all of that that you would probably have to pay extra with other builders comes with the home. So this community is gonna be a gated community. They're gonna have an 8,000 square foot clubhouse eventually. It's gonna be a really nice community. However, they just really started developing it and the models just came available a couple weeks ago. So the square footage of this community is gonna be around 1232 square feet to 2873 square feet. Um, I had an opportunity to tour all the models and they are all very nice. Lots of awesome layouts, lots of great floor plans to choose from. So the point of this video is kind of just to educate you about this brand new community. Stay tuned to future videos where I took a virtual tour or a video tour of each of the models. So the amenities that they're gonna have eventually in this community are a gated community with security, clubhouse, community trail, swimming pool and spa, fitness center, fire pit, park, picnic areas, bocce ball courts, pickleball courts, and RV parking. Now the cool thing about these home designs too is a couple of the models have RV garages and they're really nice. Now when you buy new construction, obviously you're gonna have a base price and then you're also gonna have a lot premium. A lot of the bigger homes or the, the other bigger collection, the lot premium tends to be more, and it also depends on where your home's gonna be sitting, what elevation it's gonna be in this community. Um, when they first released this community, I was seeing lot premium starting at 275,000. Initially, when they first released it, they had a huge interest list, and one of the models was listed at over a million dollars for the base price, and the lot premium at 275. But then they come to realize once they release the prices that a lot of people dropped out and was not interested any longer in this community. I am seeing a softening in Las Vegas, especially with new construction. So I hope this is the case with this community. Now, the only thing about touring the model homes with Lennar is the uh, model homes no longer has an agent rep or a sales office there. So what they have is a QR code that you have to scan in so it would upload the website so you can choose which model you wanna look at. The only problem or the only flaw of this is that internet reception in Summerlin West is awful. And it was very hard for me to actually tour these homes. And I saw a lot of clients there trying to get in, but one, didn't have a clue how to operate the QR code or two, did not have internet access. So it's something to think about if you do want to go tour these homes, obviously it's better to have a real estate agent there to help you maneuver the viewing of the model homes. Now I'm gonna go over the three different collections that this community will have. There's the Evander collection, the Cromwell collection, and also the Sterling collection. The Evander collection is the largest models of all the homes in Heritage which they feature single story layouts with three to four bay parking garages and three floor plans to choose from prices starting in the low 800s. Depending on which model you choose, the price will go up. And again, as I mentioned before, don't forget about lot premiums. 
The first model is the Ethan, and I was able to tour that model. This one is on Showcase, and it's approximately 25, 15 square feet with three beds, two and a half baths, and a four bay garage. The next model is the Elizabeth, and unfortunately they do not have that modeled in the community. And this one has 25, 16 square feet with three beds, two and a half baths, a four bay garage with RV garage. So that's pretty cool to have an RV garage. I kind of wish that they had the model home with the RV garage so we can see what it looks like, but unfortunately they don't. If you do want to see what an RV garage looks like, I do believe Heritage at Cadence in Henderson may have a sample for you. And the last of this collection is the Everly, and this is the largest one out of it. And it is 2873 square feet with three beds, three baths, and a next gen suite with a three bay garage. Now the cool thing, or a three car garage. Now the cool thing about this one with the next gen suite is that this one, the next gen suite has access to the front door. They have their own private door and they also have their own garage, which is the third car garage. And that third car garage leads into the next gen suite. So if you're thinking about um, income, if you want to have someone rent it out or if you have your adult kids that want to come live in there with you then you have that option and Lennar does an awesome job with their next gen suites it's like a little kitchenette inside it with a refrigerator and microwave it was very spacious it felt very cozy maybe mm, an 800 square foot apartment maybe the size it could be a little smaller it also had a bedroom a nice bathroom a nice walk-in closet um, hopefully i'll show pictures of it the next collection is the Sterling Collection, and these homes are a little more moderately sized. They also have three different floor plans to choose from, and all three are modeled in the community. Prices for this collection start in the mid 500s to the low 600s. And the first model is the Sawyer model, and it is approximately 1747 square feet with two bedrooms, two baths, and a two car garage. And the next model is the Sydney, with approximately 1953 square feet with three bedrooms, two baths, and a two car garage. And the last model is the Sloan model with approximately 2236 square feet, two bedrooms, two baths, and a two car garage. And our last collection is called the Cromwell Collection, and this is the smallest of all the collections. And the interesting thing about this collection is that the garage is in the front of the community and the front yard is in the back of the community where there is no real yard there's a side yard so i'll show you videos of how it's laid out um, but these are the smaller floor plans starting in the mid to high 400s they also have three floor plans to choose from and only two are modeled in this community and the first one is carson with approximately 1232 square feet two beds two baths and a two-car garage the next one is the claremont with 1237 square feet also with two beds, two baths, and a two car garage. And the last one is the Connery with approximately 1422 square feet, two beds, two baths, and two car garage. So as you can see, Heritage at Stonebridge is an awesome 55 plus community in Summerlin. It's the newest one in Summerlin and you know, it's gonna sell fast, regardless if you can see the models or not. The layouts are pretty awesome and how they designed it is pretty nice too. If you are interested in buying this community, you can always give me a call at 702-370-5112. I am your local Summerlin expert. I know a lot about Summerlin. I know a lot about Summerlin retirement communities and new construction in Summerlin. I am your go-to Summerlin gal seriously <laughs> but if you like this channel you know what to do right be sure to hit the thumbs up button leave a comment down below share with a friend and smash that subscribe button thank you so much for watching and Ozzy and I can't wait to see you guys on the next one